Hello and welcome to the very first episode of Death Stranding Blind Playthrough. Woohoo! I have been waiting like three weeks to play this game, so I'm very excited. For those of you who do follow me, you know I just recently finished The Last of Us. I was actually very nervous to start this because I don't know if any game is going to be able to stand up against The Last of Us. But I have heard th good things about Death Stranding, so I thought I'd give it a shot. Another action-y type game, I believe, but as it is blind, I honestly don't know anything about this game. I am playing on easy, just because, well, I suck at these. <laughs> um, but really, we're just going to jump right in. Let's, let's kind of start the story here. I kind of went through all the settings. With no, hey, I, I'm not there anymore. I'm not the one with little to no action game experience who find action games difficult. I, I, I definitely am there. So we're going to start on easy just for this playthrough. I, if I really enjoy the game, I'll probably go back and play it on like a normal mode. I plan to replay The Last of Us and kind of catch anything that I missed there. All of you awesome people that watch left so many good comments for me to go back and, and replay that. So I'm excited to do that. But this game, the only thing that I know about it is it's something about the guy off of The Walking Dead. Though I don't think there's any ties to that. And there's a baby in a little tomb thing. So that's just pretty much what I know. So let's watch this beginning cutscene here. Maybe it'll answer some questions for us. Okay. The rope along with the stick are two of mankind's oldest tools. The stick to keep the bad away, the rope used to bring the good towards us. They were our first friends and of our own invention. Whenever wait, <laughs> I didn't get to read it all. Once there was an explosion. A bang which gave birth to time and space. Once there was an explosion. A bang which set a planet spinning in that space. Once there was an explosion. A bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. Hmm. Those are some deep words, Daryl. Wow, look how beautiful that is. Death Stranding. Is it, is this what the game looks like? Oh my god, it looks incredible already. Norman Reedus, that's his name. He's off The Walking Dead to those who haven't watched it. I don't know who this guy is. Mikkelsen? Michelson? <laughs> I know how to read. Say oh do I. Alright, we got somebody out there on like a motorcycle type deal. He mentioned like the fourth explosion. Would that have been the explosion of the dinosaurs that destroyed off and put them extinct? Is that what he's referencing to? Wow. I can tell you already this game looks incredible. Darren Jacobs. I hope his name's Daryl. I don't have to relearn somebody's name. Nice glasses, man. Holy crap, look at his face. It's so clear. Oh, 
Did that rain just burn him? It was like acidic. Oh man. What? That was pretty cool. Those were hand prints. Like human hand prints. That didn't sound like no human though. Oh crap. Well, we know that there's wildlife. Oh crap. No, don't fall, dear. Don't fall. You can do it. No. The rain. Oh my god. It is acidic. Look at that. have one of those dream catchers. <laughs> oh man, we get to take control. This is not safe. Okay. Wow, that's some small text. Grab with your right hand. Okay. Transfer cargo from hand to back. Oh, okay. Oh, I can only hold so much weight so I can't pick up everything? R1, tap to scan. Where'd that lady go? What are the red things? Life? Rocks. Where the hell did that lady go? Oh, there's something over here. What is going on? So we just slam into some lady and we're not even going to talk about it, Daryl? Oh, oh, oh. Sorry, dude. Seriously? Seriously. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> Don't talk to me like that. Carry on back. You picked up head of distribution of central something drop cargo. One likes received. What? You will sometimes find cargo from abandoned delivery de deliveries dotted about the landscape. Delivering this cargo to its intended destination in good condition will make, a v make you very popular. Is that important? Should I should I want to be popular? I want to know where the heck this lady went. There's a star, so that's got to be where I'm needing to go, right? Oh. Over here. Over here. Oh. Whoops. Okay. Well, X marks the spot, but I'm, I wasn't seeing things, right? I swear there was some chick standing there and I, I just bashed right into her with my motorcycle thing. I'm not crazy. L2, R2 to grip. That's to grip my backpack. I don't want to grip my backpack. Wow, let's just start this game out successfully. Watch me fail at finding my destination. Alright, if this tells you anything about how how well I am at these games, we're going to get along great. Maybe I have to continue to go down. That's got to be it. i got to just have to go down. Ooh. 
Oh, man, right through here, huh? Oh, of course. Of course, that's the most obvious way. Maybe this will answer the question of the lost lady. Like, I'm so concerned for a jump, climb. Climb continuously. Can I climb these rocks? No? You're obviously telling that me that for a reason, though. Well, the scan feature is really cool, though. Obviously, the X is... There's two different stars. Oh. Yes, sir. Hey, wait, I wanted to go pick that up. You can't just cut me off like that. I'm not a turd. It looks just like him. His name is Sam. That is insane. How this character looks just like him. I'm pretty sure I saw a trailer or something that they use those sticky things that go on your face to sort of like CGI it. <gasps> There's another deer. He's got handprints all over him. What? No. Wonder what that skull is for. What's going on? Oh, ho, ho, ho. When he stepped in the mud, the mud indented, but the picture didn't even change. we hit like handprints. Frick you, game. seriously going on right now. Obviously the acid doesn't affect them. Wow. Look at that detail. Oh. Okay. Do they know each other?
The storm has passed. Today on your nightly news, acid rain will fall, and weird hand people will walk around and scare the hell out of you. Oh, he's crying. Porter. Hmm. I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor, but I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, so I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Sam Porter preaches. The man who delivers. Please don't eat it. <laughs> no, don't eat it. A crypto buy it a day keeps the time fall away. I can't watch. Oh. <coughs> Stop. Stop enjoying it. Oh. Wanna come work for me? It must be tough out here on your own. Yeah, I thought Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few in his folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I make deliveries, that's all. to town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. Him. The time for fast forwards whatever it touches, but it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges. Hmm. Hold on, hold on. So, deliver one more consignment of smart drugs. The red bar is the blood gauge. When it reaches zero, Sam will die. The blue bar is stamina. As the gauge depletes, Sam moves more slowly and maintaining his balance is harder. Okay. So, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. How do I pause this? Hey, hey, Whoa. Hey. So, for one, they mentioned that. Some can see these things, but he's not there yet. He can sense them. I don't want to see these things. Just by the handprint, they seem way too human-like. And then the time fall, they called it? Is that because the Earth exploded, as he said earlier? So what is this? Lost cargo tools. 
I'm gonna carry that on my back. So I can carry up to 120. You picked up ahead of distribution. Blah, 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 blah. So what are these things? Obviously I can scan. So let me go grab this item over here. So I, don't be serious, low roar. So I don't have to necessarily be s sneaky, do I? Oh, I don't want to eat that thing. Are you serious? Hey, where'd he go? I really did want to eat him. Hey! I scared it. My bad. Do I have to go down there? I guess so. Listen to this music, though. I'm assuming those bugs are like health, essentially. They they alleviate something, whether it's health or stanima or blood, I suppose they called it. So what happens if we fall? Smart drugs. Oh, this music. The endurance gauge appears above the stanima gauge when performing actions that wear in Sam's body when the gauge fully depletes. Sam can no longer bear his load. Be sure to take a break before that happens. So I can carry it around with my hand or I can just put it on my back. Smart drugs, delivery, order acquired. Total three, four. Wait, what? I don't know why I keep yelling. Nor do I know exactly what I'm looking for here. But this music is catchy as heck! I feel like the scan thing's pretty nifty. But I don't know how accurate it is. this do? Zoom sunglasses. An old favorite of Sam. Sunglasses is designed with homoludins in mind. Their form encourages the weather or wear never forgets their playful side. Customized. We can customize ourselves. We have monster we have monster energy. <laughs> okay. Wow. Game looks great. Oh, I'm so excited to start this. I have a good feeling I'm gonna get lost a lot. But not that you guys will have to know, I'll just cut all that the shenanigans out. This is our next destination. Oh I wanna eat the bug. Eat. Using cryobites to restore blood levels. Losing too much blood will cause your movements to become sluggish and make it hard to keep your balance. Eating Cryptobiots will rapidly restore your blood levels. Okay, so essentially they're little health capsules. Is this our other thing of drugs? Disc based media. Well, I might as well just carry it. So all of these are like deliveries? Because look, they're stacking up literally on his back. How do you even carry all that weight, sir? Well, that was not my des next destination like I thought it was going to be. And I don't have like a map that I have found out. This like has to be my map. Holy crap, look at this guys. I couldn't figure out 
deliver one or more consignment of smart drugs. Okay, that's great, but how do I... R1 to hold breath by holding it. Scan terrain. Right hand action, left hand action. Enter compass mode. Oh, okay. Oh, sweet! So I gotta go over there. Alright, let me make sure that was it, though. Please tell me this is the music that's gonna play the whole game. It's probably not because it's just doing credits right now, but I love it. It's got a nice peaceful side that I feel like for a game, this game is not gonna be so peaceful. Ah, dude. I love how he talks to you. Oh, here's a camp, okay. Key cargo for the smart drug delivery order location. Smart drugs. Wait, I wanted to see if there's anything up here. Okay. Can I just jump down? Will this harm me? Ow! Stop! Okay, those are more smart drugs I can pick up, huh? So let me come a little higher on the... I don't know how true that is. I might just be wasting time here. But it looks like... It's like right over here. You can do it, dude. Oh, I just ran out of stamina. Try standing still. <laughs> Stand up. Thank you. <laughs> that was terrible. Alright. Don't try to run when you're in the water. It will deplete your stamina bar uh, very, very fast. Okay, we're good. More smart drugs, because I had three of four, huh? Whoa. Whoa. Slow down, horsey. My gosh. Okay. Minimum required is one, so if I deliver more, do I get more experience? More items? Like, what is it that we're... Oh, I was holding my breath. I want to know what that is. It was carrying too much cargo. If you find yourself swaying left or right, use L or R2 to shift your weight to the opposite direction. Well, I went and picked up too much crap. Oh, well. I like to live dangerously. Alright, let's see where we need to go here. Central Knot City. See, I don't understand what these words mean. I need to get to the camp though, right? Well, let's head that way. Central something. My webcam's in the way. We made it to sem central something though. Scan. Cargo verified. Thank you. Oh. I think I need to relocate my webcam next time, guys. Well, we made it here to whatever sort of camp this is. This looks like a very... It looks very well done for the... I mean, it looks like this whole world's abandoned. But then it's got this amazing technology and look at this solid built building. Like, that doesn't make any sense to me. Unless this is very, very recent. Notice, access permit required. Alright, well let's see what's, what's going on in here. We gotta deliver this stuff, right? I'll hold down the button. When you see the square icon, you will need to hold down. Try holding it down until the delivery terminal shuts. Note that you also need to hold down buttons other than square. Make delivery. Delivery requested cargo. Well, that's an interface. Smart drug deliver delivery, right? All cargo required is ready to be delivered. The order can be completed. Perfect. So what's this? Return lost. The piece of lost cargo was meant to... Was meant to, It will be returned to its recipient. Perfect. Oh, I gotta hold it down. Good Samaritan. Cargo. 
So you got. What took you so long? It's not like the legend to come in late. Had to wait out the storm. Lost my bike. Sounds like you've been through the ringer. Luckily, our goods are in perfect condition. Well, you did keep us waiting, but everything else seems to be in perfect order, so great work. We'll be awaiting the next delivery. She has handcuffs on. Results. Order smart dog delivery. Yay. Four out of four. Look at my pro status right now. So I'm gaining likes. What? Okay. Awesome. I did great. Delivering is what I do. Okay. I'm so confused here. So I delivered everything that I picked up pretty much. I should have picked up that last one, but it said my bag was full. But I should have assumed the first part was meant to be easy. But I, I don't understand. Likes earned. Why am I gaining likes? What, what does it have to pertain to do with anything? Delivery volume? Okay, okay. Miscellaneous? Okay. Wonderful. So I'm trying to fill up the star. Is that like my level then? Do likes pertain to level? Am I on Facebook in this game and this is some virtual reality game? And where are all the people? Obviously people know me. That's a funny looking guy. What's up, dude? Igor, Bridges Corpse Disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. Not the touchy-feely type. Document said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges Corpse Disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. Sam Porter Bridges. Bridges Corpse Removal? I'm trying to connect the dots here. Bridges CDT. Come and take a look. He's got a date with the incinerator. How long since he flatlined? We don't know the exact TOD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. He wasn't quarantined. Not sick. This is a suicide. Oh, Jesus. We're just lucky we found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. Where are you taking him? Uh, closest incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with BTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. And put all that Kyrillium in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with dooms. That's the second time they've mentioned dooms. Well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So how about it? Can we count on you? Then Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. BTs. That's another thing they haven't That's mentioned why we anything came about. Prepared. A bridge baby, huh? With its help and you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. <gasps> There's that baby. 
Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. It freaks me out, too. Roll out! What? Okay, first off, I have so many freaking questions. Dooms? So, he's a doom, meaning he can sense or see, essentially, these BTs? That's what they were calling them? BTs meaning what? Bluetooth? Are these guys Bluetooth? Did Bluetooth take over the world? And then that mo freaking ho is holding a baby on his chest, acting like an incubator. This doesn't make any sense. You know, the world was different when I was a kid. America is a country. Anybody can go anywhere in a damn well place. No need for couriers like yourself. We had highways, airplanes. No, we could even visit other countries. So this was after Hard normal to life. It now. As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. And if you were lucky enough to survive, the time fall came and washed you away. And those freaks from the beach showed up. The worlds of the living and the dead all mixed together. And that's when folks started holing up in the cities. Couriers like yourself got put up on a pedestal. Wonder where we are. Son like, of a bitch. Rainbow! Does that mean more of those guys? How much no. further to the incinerator? This guy's about to pop. Shit. We're at the cut to the BTs. about this. Are they following us? Oh man. Where am I looking? Ah! Turn faster. Uh -oh. I'm too scared to turn around. Well, he said he couldn't see him, so that means I can't see him, right? The engine stalled. Of Tesla's course. Got us right where they want us. Get us out of here. Sam, can you see anything? I can't see them. No, nothing. You can sure as heck hear him, though. BB must be busted or something. My heart. So it sounds like these guys can evolve. Oh no, oh no, turn. Okay, so these guys, so he's like some sort of infected? So is he turning into one of those BTs? Oh man, what's going on? I don't see anything. I see shadows. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Grass is dying. And growing? So it's growing and dying? But not one has harmed us yet. And that's some bright blood. 
Why are we so worried about this guy changing? Oh no. Should have just burned the dang body right there. Oh, that thing warns them? Wouldn't they hear the little... <laughs> oh, here they are again. What are they and why are they so heavy? And why do they have people handprints? Questions are going to be answered. There was a skull. What do you see? <gasps> I saw it. See him? I didn't think anybody could. They're people. He's crying because he's allergic, not What the hell? I can't handle anymore. What the fuck? What the hell was that? The 
babies out of the womb? Or the incubator? saw them before they were just like light shadows but those were physical figures does that mean he leveled up Follow him, Sam. What are you doing? Gosh, okay. Okay, let's talk about this for a minute. First off, that was mother freaking intense. Second off, I have so many gosh darn questions, okay? But what I've what I've countered from this so far is Sam Porter Bridges is a doom. Apparently a specific level where he could sense these things. Well, I think that he just leveled up because now instead of those five figures in the in the distance being all fuzzy and transparent, they were very very physical figures. I could be wrong, but that's that's what I I'm gathering so far. Another thing that we learned, wow, my eyes are watering, that was so intense. Another thing that we've learned is BTs. I'm not sure what that stands for, but I'm guessing that's what they call these creatures. These tar-like, human-like creatures. And then whenever these guys show up, he starts to cry. Not because of emotion, but because of allergies? That's what What's-Her-Face said, and see, I had already forgotten her name. Um, fragile, that was her name. So Fragile, because she said you're allergic to or something to that sense. So this is pretty nuts. I still have a lot of questions and I don't want to end the episode here, but I have to because we're already about, I'm an hour in and my editing software won't handle anything over an hour. So 
I guess we'll see what happens in the next episode. I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in to the very first episode of Death Stranding Blind Playthrough. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. And I'll see you in episode two.